So let's take a look at the uh, unified uh, routing diagnostics that we can do with this, okay? Uh, here is the Omnichannel Admin Center app, right? So I'm gonna click on this one and this will open up uh, the, the administration and let me just close this down and I'm gonna click here on diagnostics under the advanced settings, right? So I click on diagnostics and then I'm going to turn on routing diagnostics, okay? It says uh, pressing this will enable unified routing diagnostics for this org, okay? So I'm gonna turn this on and I'm just gonna click yes here. And this is gonna be useful for, uh, you know, seeing how the routing works, right? So there's, there's nothing in here at the moment. Now let's go ahead and uh, do the same thing we did before and then we should be able to see some of these records coming through. So I'm just gonna do this one more time, right? So um, I'm gonna, I'm, the, the customer here is going to select support and he's going to submit this. And once he submits it, it's going through the, uh, the routing that we set up, the skill-based routing, and we get the uh, incoming uh, uh, chat here, right? So David's gonna go ahead and accept that one. And uh, as expected, he's the one that got it because he's a support guy and uh, it comes in and then we can basically um, uh, chat with the customer, okay? So uh, the chat's gone through. Now let's take a look at the unified routing now. So when we refresh this here, we see that uh, we do have one record created. And let's go ahead and uh, just open this up and see what it looks like. So we have the uh, routing diagnostics and we have here the uh, assignment was completed and it says uh, unit based available capacity ascending uh, round robin. That's all good. Let's go ahead and take a look at the assignment tab and then we can see here status is applied and we can see here the rule item, uh, omnichannel assignment, exact unit based, right? And then if we just go and look at this here, the condition, right? Let me zoom over this. It says uh, base presence status in conversation, work stream, allowed presences, and the unit based available capacity is greater than or equal to the work stream capacity and the uh, user skills exact match. So really that last line there says that uh, this user had the exact match skills and that's why it was routed to him. So that's a look at how the uh, unified routing comes into play here. Hope you guys enjoyed. So that's it guys. If you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and of course, check out my blog at carldesuza.com.